Well, uh, BT is delighted to be uh, given the honour to organise this, which is now the National Treasure. It's in its 54th year, our 18th year of organising the event. Um, BT is a telecommunications and IT services company, but we somehow managed to become really expert at organising this event, and uh, it's going to be fantastic this year. We have new shows around the uh, the RDS. We have our 550 projects, and as ever, the standard is as higher than ever. Uh, we also have a couple of new uh, events this year. We have Mindshare event with Kevin Mitnick, was on the FBI Most Wanted list, uh, so we have that show on Thursday, and uh, we have a Girl in the Galaxy, so Nora Patton, the first Irish astronaut in training is going to be here as well so lots to look forward to and really exciting time ahead and in terms of the projects themselves then any particular trends emerging this year as, as they usually do in most years yeah every year we see the students being naturally interested in the issues uh, of the current day in uh, both from the classroom so things around uh, uh, classroom anxiety uh, but also then uh, fake news obviously mr. Trump is in the is in the news a lot homelessness uh, the environment so again students naturally interested in trying to fix the issues or be naturally interested in the issues that surround them. Mm -hmm. And of course the awards then uh, taking place on, on Friday evening and I think you've made a bit of a change in terms of the top prize, a bit of, bit of an extra boost there for whoever wins it. Yeah, BT have stumped up uh, another, an extra uh, prize money this year, so we're 7,500 uh, uh, euros for the winner and uh, a trip to Bletchley Park uh, sponsored by BT, so uh, the winner has that in store. But there's over 140 prizes as well, so lots to go around and uh, uh, as I said, looking forward to the standard being as high as ever this year, looking forward to, uh, to the and the winner being announced on Friday afternoon. Mm -hmm. And I, I suppose once once again, you could have taken in a lot more projects, uh, potentially if you had the space to do it, than, than you, you did, uh, such was the, the, the interest in uh, applying this year. Yeah, the, the, every year the BT Young Science and Technology Exhibition gets bigger, so we have over two and a half, or sorry, 2,100 uh, entrants this year, and we can only display 550 this year. We have 1,200 students who will be here during the week. 60% um, female, 40% male, uh, and yes, uh, standard is very high as ever. To get in here alone is an achievement in itself, so uh, well done to the students who, who will be here this week. And uh, in terms of the public then, are they uh, invited to come and, and visit from when? The public, it opened to the public from Thursday morning uh, right through to Saturday evening. So we're hoping to get uh, over 50,000 uh, public here and there's lots of them to do. There's 20 shows per day. We have 60 exhibitors here.